Hey miners, we're going to continue with our brand spotlight on six leaf knives. Yes, this is a knife. Uh, this video is brought to you courtesy of six leaf knives. This is the SL13. It is comes in chaotic red G10. There are a couple more colors. I believe they have a green with this. Uh, and this kind of this texture for you know this size and shape for fitting in your pocket real well it's a front flipper knife with an I'll admit is a little bit difficult to get used to uh, stick around at the end I'll show you guys how that works but I think it's a really good knife for those of you who like box cutter style knives that type of thing uh, we'll go ahead and get into this what I've found is you want to use the side of your thumb and you gotta kind of throw it, kind of throw it, uh, yep. kind of throw it up. Okay. Uh, that's what we're taking a look at there. A light stone wash on a D2 blade. The six leaf logo, if you can see, there it is. Kind of a sheep's foot blade. And more of the. Uh, Stone wash or bead blast. Rattlesnake logo. Try to get that. There you go. The model number. And the blade steel. There's your lockup. Nice access to the lockup. It's got some jimping or some serrations. Oh, and it's got, it does lock up. You know, it's not, uh, not past 30% maybe 20 percent uh, but it does push over easy it is running on ceramic bearings we'll try that again and you'll have to I can't really do this one uh, behind the camera so oh you could probably slow roll this okay lock it up uh, what are we going to do here we're going to cut calendar and today, we're taking a look. It says, while vacation in Africa, Pinocchio had his longtime wish to be a real boy suddenly, unexpectedly granted. Okay, love the far side. Here we go with a paper cut test. Oh, perfect. And that thing just locked up on me. I didn't, must not have had it closed uh, properly. Let's do our foam peanut. Perfect. Oh, didn't want to do that one. Kind of quit on me right there. All right, I'm gonna need to do a little bit of a stropping on this one, maybe. That edge doesn't have have the bite. It's got a nice thinness to it. Doesn't quite have the bite. So I think uh, comparison wise you guys are going to see a Civivi has the K the Kai V. I believe it's a KI dash V. And that's running $45 and you get 9 CR blade steel. And with this one we're looking at $26. These are on Amazon and AliExpress. And for size comparison, what I thought I'd do is bring out a dollar. And just taking a dollar, I really wanted to have a 20, but I don't have any of those. So take and fold that up like I like to do. And that's what we're looking at. Just about kind of, it's actually smaller than the dollar here. So. Uh, while we're speaking of that, did you guys know that they make $100 bills? I've never seen one. Uh, someone told me that, I didn't believe them, and I asked the bank, and yeah, yeah they do. So, kind of blew me away. Uh, we're going to bring out the Rough Rider I showed you guys. This is a lockback. And we'll compare this way to give you guys an idea of a couple small knives that are out there, kind of small carry knives. So, 
you'll see this Rough Rider I hope in another video I'll show you guys uh, when I with a six leaf knife so that's a six leaf SL 13 thanks for your time